regarding the collection I'm exhibiting uh, at Dash, it's a collection, uh, what I would call my women series. Um, all through the years I have gone mainly to, uh, in, into two directions, landscape and women. Uh, and I, I do maybe one or two exhibitions on one of the subjects and then sometimes uh, I have the other subject coming in. I never choose what I'm, what I'm going to, to do next, and I just move, move along as it, as it comes. Uh, the, the, the works I'm showing in, um, in Tash uh, <coughs> are works that are, uh, that are focused on women faces, women figures, and yet in some of the works, some of the uh, foliage that I've been working with lately had already started to come in. Regarding the function of art, um, because the function of art has uh, changed from one era to the other. At the beginning it was used for religious purposes and then uh, the patrons of the art paid to get their uh, portraits done. And so the, the function of art was to satisfy different the, the clergy, the religion and then to the patrons. And then in the modern period, it was mainly to satisfy the artist and the human being. And so the, the function of art, really art is, is a quest for meaning. Um, it's a, a search into, into the mysterious. The artist is looking into the mysterious and by experiencing it. I think art is a, uh, is a glorification of the human intellect and, and feelings, really. It's, uh, it glorifies it because it's, uh, it reaches all the time newer boundaries in, in, uh, for the, uh, in showing the imagination of the human beings, in showing the dexterity and the uh, technical um, possibilities of the human being. So in one way, it, is, it gives a lot of satisfaction to the human kind that they can achieve something in that uh, respect. It also presents the uniqueness and universality of, of the, the, the human imagination and intellect. 